for today's video, I'll be doing a peachy and glowy summer makeup look because I feel like I've never really done a summer makeup look on this channel. Also, most of the products that I'll be using for this makeup look are from O2O, which is a brand that is available in Shopee. Honestly, I haven't tried any of their products before, but I've been seeing YouTubers creating makeup looks using their brand. I feel like this video is gonna be a first impressions video, but anyway, let's get started. As you can tell, I already did my foundation and I used this Innisfree Skin Fit Glow Cushion. I'm in the shade 23N and this is my holy grail. I talked about this a lot on my channel and this is so great especially if you want to achieve that glow. It doesn't even look like I have anything on my face and this is medium coverage because you can still see like my pimples but yeah, I still love this because it's very glowy. So now I'm gonna start with O2O's concealer and this is the high coverage liquid concealer and they've sent me the shade HCO2. This is the box and I love that it is rose gold. So this is the product. It's also rose gold on the lid. It kind of reminds me of Fenty Beauty's Pro Filter Instant Retouch Concealer. By the way, you guys, this is 110 pesos, which is so affordable because you get this amount of product. This is the applicator, and now I'm just gonna apply it under my eyes. And on the parts of my face where I need concealer. I'm just gonna blend this area first because I don't want to mess it up when I do my brows. I'm just using my fingers to blend. So high coverage and I love that it is so easy to blend. By the way, I also have pimple over there so I'm just gonna apply it. So now I'm just gonna let the concealer on this area sit for a while. This will allow them to warm up. While waiting, I'm gonna do my brows and I'm using this O2O's Brow Styling Soap. This one doesn't have a tint. I do have the other three tinted brow soaps which are this one but I'm not sure if I'm going to use them for this makeup look because I just really want to have like natural brows. O2O has sent me the shade Light Brown. Just this one. So this is what it looks like. And then, this is the brown. And lastly is the color black. So now I'm just taking this facial mist from Fresh Skin Lab. And I'm gonna spray it on this pan, which is the transparent brow soap. I know I've said in my past videos that I don't like how bushy brows look on me, but I think I want to try it today. So I'm just brushing it reversely on how my brows really look like. And I'm just shaping it. I'm taking Teviant Brow Mate in the shade Deep Brown and I'm just gonna fill in the tail of my brows because I don't have enough brow hairs on that area. Pencil is so good, especially if you want to mimic brow hairs because the pencil is so thin. Now that my brows are Cara Delevingne, I'm gonna blend the concealer. Next 
Makeup Blush and I'm taking the Pick Me Makeup Clay from O2O. This is in the shade number 5, orange. So I'm just gonna dab it on my cheeks. Next is highlighter, but since my face is already glowy, I'm just gonna put a little on the inner corners of my eyes. Next, I'm gonna use the BYS Translucent Powder and I'm gonna set the parts of my face where it usually gets oily. and I'm using the Tuco for School Art Class by Rodin. I'm gonna contour my nose with it, starting between my brows down to my nose tip. Next is eyes, and I'm gonna take the Pick Me Makeup Clay from O2O in the shade number 5 Orange. This is what I use for my blush. For mascara, I'm using the O2O Instant Oversize Volume Lengthening Fiber Mascara. For the lips, I'm taking the Velvet Matte Lip Cream from O2O. This is in the shade 7 Candy. Here it is. I'm using this as a tint because I feel like the shade is darker for the makeup look that I want to achieve. For the last step, I'm using the Innisfree Lip Oil to add some gloss. 